This looks like a funny way to store your dishes. I'm not sure they're for eating out of. There's a big rod running right through the middle of them. Probably comes as a surprise to you to find out that of all the things glass has been used for, music is one of them. You can play glass instruments in one of two ways, basically. I know. You can play them like a percussion instrument and tap on them gently with hammers. Oops. I guess that was a little too hard. Or you can play them by running your moistened finger around the rim, like the bowls in this set in front of us. You can see that they're mounted so that by turning the wheel on the left, you can rotate them slowly or more quickly if you want to. I get it. Rub your wet finger on the different size bowls and you get different notes. This music sounds a little spooky. There were some famous composers who wrote for glass instruments, but there came a time when people began to get nervous of the curious otherworldly sounds that glass music produced. And in fact, in some places, public performance of glass instruments was banned because people were afraid these strange sounds would drive the public mad. The music from this glass harmonica is nice, but I sure don't want to wait around and find out if it'll make me crazy as a cuckoo bird. Yeah, let's go.